Maybe the idea of working with electricity charges your batteries. Or maybe it doesn't get you buzzing. Maybe we get it. We get it. You want a job doing something you enjoy, something you love, and something that makes you enough money that money's not something you stress about. After high school, there are tons of options, which is why today we're going someplace that does something untraditional. Let's get out there. Today, we're at the Northwest Lyman College, and we're talking to Chance. He's training so that he can keep you connected to the power grid. What is alignment? It's understanding transformers, how to hook them up. Lineman is because power line. You're a power line man. Yep. For you personally, why electricity? Like what sparked your interest in this field? I was always thinking I was gonna go to traditional four-year college, business major. I didn't have any big ideas for what I wanted to do. And I'd had a teacher that talked about going into the trades and the benefits to it. And it was something that sounded really interesting to me, working outside, working on power systems. So I started doing some research into it and talked to a lot of different schools about it. How'd you find out that this lineman college in Idaho existed? Like, how'd you even find it? Went straight to Google. Google, yep. yes. What makes this place unique? Like, what makes it awesome? I'd say the experience of the instructor you come out here, the instructors know how to help people in different situations. They've seen it all, both in the field and with students. I know that what I do here is what I'll be doing out there. The only thing that's different is that the lines outside aren't energized, so it's safer for us. No, I'm just having a blast doing what I'll be doing for work. What this really does is it gives you a better understanding of things that you'll have to learn as you go through an apprenticeship, and it gives you a huge upper hand on anyone who's just coming off the street. What type of learner are you? It would be working with my hands, doing something that's almost like building crafts and being able to take pride in the work you do. So walk me through what your typical day looks like. I get here about 7.30. Then we'll head over to the vehicle garage. I'll grab my tools. I'll meet up with some of my crew members. Got to get our hard hat, safety glasses, and gloves on. We we'll walk out there. We'll wait for our instructor to come out. We'll do a briefing and go over any safety hazards. We'll talk about what we're going to do. We'll do a demonstration if we're learning a new skill that day. We'll break up and do our up downs, just like some physical training, and then grab all the equipment we need, get up the poles, and start working. Then I have half hour lunch. We meet back in the classroom, and then I have two classes split up, uh, each about an hour and a half. What are the opportunities for you after getting out here to get a job? If you're willing to travel, it's almost guaranteed that you'll get a job, hoping to either go into a pre-apprentice, apprentice, groundman, any entry level position I can get. You have options. There's no puff and no fluff about it. And maybe you think you don't. Maybe you think it's either four year traditional college, or nothing. And you know what? That is a load of bull. Chance found a place where he could learn more about what he was into, could take steps every day forward. Isn't that the key? To not go backwards and not get stuck in one place? Step by step, line by line, always moving forward? Places like this exist for all sorts of things that could take your future where you want it to be. When you hear about something cool, look into it. Keep an open mind. Find people like Chance and ask questions because you really have no idea where it might lead. Thanks for watching. We really appreciate it. Be sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram. And if you're watching on YouTube right now, click this little weird bubble thing and you can subscribe to our channel. If you're not on YouTube, go to YouTube and then subscribe to our channel because we have awesome videos coming out all the time. Bye.